that just doesn't feel right about the labor market. If you have a job, you're probably worried about keeping it. And if you're out looking for work, you're probably sending off resume after resume and not hearing back from anyone. Welcome to what one labor expert calls the new normal. Well, one of the things that we like to say is it, the new normal is constant change. Um, I would characterize today's workers as disposable workers. Now it seems like these joblessness is the new norm. And, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if while there's folks would be able to accept 6% unemployment, well, their 10% unemployment becomes the new norm. And that has a devastating effect for workers. We're more likely to see lots of people in temporary contingent work and freelance work. Um, just-in-time employment is where an employer might hire you for a small period of time. People holding multiple jobs. Um, that really is becoming the new normal. The person who is in that same job for many years really is, is sort of not existing anymore. Is there anything in the new normal that is a safe career or even a career? Well, you know, I could say today uh, you know, there are certain particular industries that are higher growth industries, but I would never say anything is safe in this kind of environment because I can't predict what an occupation today would seem to me logically never going to be either outsourced or globalized. You know, some of the work that we've done is showing how the system that's in this country to try to help people get back on their feet and get a job is completely out of sync with the today's economy and the labor market and the realities. Kathy Crepsio also told me she doesn't think it's possible for the economy to add enough new jobs each month to replace the millions lost during the last recession. I'm Rhonda Schaffler. This is Reuters.